wow. That's like freaking me. Hit the scar. It's like I'm standing there, but I'm not there. I'm Hi there, I'm here at Micreo 3D with John here, and we're gonna create myself a new mini me. Because Welcome, my, Dr. Steele. Thank you. So, what can we do? What's the process of uh, well, the, creating my mini me? The first step is you have your, your outfit on that you wanna. Okay. Of course, yeah. Okay. He's Perfect. gonna look just That's like good. me. Um, so, the first step is we get you into the rig. Uh, you stand the in rig. the center. Uh, we have a 60 camera digital DSLR rig. Stand in the center. You snap a photo. Uh, we do five or six different shots because we want to make sure that we have a usable one that, that works for us. Um, and that's it for you. For the customer, they leave. And then on the back end, uh, we have a program that stitches all the pictures to credit together, makes a mesh, and then adds a texture on top of that to create a lifelike figurine of yourself. Wow. Um, after the, the file's created, it goes to the printer. Uh, prints one layer at a time. It takes about uh, 16 hours to print. And then... And how does it print? What's it made out of? Uh, it's a gypsum powder type material. So it's a powder uh, and it just prints one layer at a time. Successive layers and basically glue and ink holds it all together and you get a full six million color uh, 3D selfie of yourself. Six million color? Six million color. Wow, and what kind of things, what, ki what kind of do people come in for? Uh, we have a very wide customer base. Um, as you can see, well, we can show no, no, no. us some samples here of what we've done. Um, so uh, the wedding cake topper will start at the top here. Uh, so anybody that wants to do away with the plastic sort of generic uh, wedding cake toppers that you see, you know, typically, um, you can have a exact replica of the what you're wearing on your special day and you'll have that for the rest of your life. You keep it on your mantle place. Um, you obviously don't eat it with the cake. You, no, okay, yeah. I was gonna ask that. Yeah. It's not edible. Um, and then we have a uh, mom with baby here. So oh, yeah, so you, you can capture your mom with baby, your little child. Yeah. You want to commemorate, uh, you know, the birth of your child, uh, uh, a pregnancy ones with mom with, uh, you know, a big belly when she comes in, if she wants to get that done. You can also uh, get... Uh, kids sports is a, is a big one. Uh, people that want, uh, you know, you want to capture your kid in peewee or bantam. Uh, you know, just do one every year to see them grow up and as they, uh, you know, you put the put their team logo on there, put their number, uh, their baseball stats if they're any good. <laughs> wow. And, uh, oh, yeah. you got a real baby in there? That's actually my son. That's your son? Yeah. He's uh, six months old. We, you know he's not supposed to eat giraffes, right? No, he's, we tried to, it's the only way I could keep him calm in the rig though. <laughs> oh wow, that's pretty cool. You can have your baby yeah. forever. Forever. You can even have them on your dashboard. Hold them in your hands. I know a lot of moms don't want their little ones to grow up. Wow. This is just freaking amazing. And this one is my mini me. Oh, that's you. That's your mini me. Yeah. So do the pose. Wow. Hello. How are you? <laughs> oh, look. It's, it's your good side. Now we got to get one on your other side, like, you know, with the horns. <laughs> Excellent. All right, so let's get the process started. Yes, let's uh, let's get you in the rig. Okay. Okay, so follow me. Now, I came in here a few days ago to get a mini me created. Yes, you did. And I went yeah. through the process, you took the photos yep. and whatnot, and you say it's done? It's ready for you to see, are you ready? I'm ready, let's sure. check it out. Okay. <laughs> Holy crap, check this out. It's like one sixteenth my size. Looks just like me. Oh wow, the beautiful head. Nice outfit, I'm quite the classic dresser. It's got even the little like little little thingies on my shoes. Wow. Oh my gosh. It's got your ring there. It's got my evil ring. Oh yeah. The beautiful blue eyes. Sexy. <laughs> Oh my, oh, check out the butt. It's got my butt. I've got a lot of Zumba, <laughs> I'm telling you. Oh my gosh, wow, this is so freaking cool. Looks just like me. It's a one-eighth scale. One-eighth scale. 
my freaking mini me. Oh, the wrinkles. Wow. So anybody can get these done, right? Anybody, yeah. And you guys are going to be at um, Fan Expo. Fan Expo. Come see us at our booth at the Fan Expo and love to you know do some cosplayers and anybody in their hard earned their costumes that they work hard on. We Right, in case they heard you. Yeah, so anyone who's got like Fan Expo, who's got cool costumes, come over to the 3D booth. Dr. Steve will be there <laughs> with his mini me and have your photo taken. Um, whether you want to get a, a figurine done will be up to you. You will be able to see a 3D copy, right? Yep. They will be? Send out the digital copy before we do the print for people to see and they, we host it on the website so they can go in, you know, rotate, zoom in, see all that kind of great stuff. Yeah, because a lot of the costumes I've seen out there, I mean, you guys work so hard for it. I mean, like every little detail. So why not have a, like a 3D version of yourself? <laughs> it's freaking cool. <laughs> My mini me. Really? Mikrio3D.com <laughs>